But before we go into Grand Finals, we got some ads to throw at you. We got Congo Saga. Now, I was calling this out, uh, advertising for this, like, a couple months ago. Can you believe that Congo Saga is coming up in, like, three weeks? Yeah. Oh, my God. Like They always sneak up on you. Yeah. I remember when Civil War was approaching. Yeah. And we always thought, like, it, it'll never be here. And then it was here. Yeah. The and SoCal got, Chronicles, yeah. the second edition, January 4th, 2020. The first weekend of the new year. Right. We got Cruise. We got... Squad, we got squad strike. We got like doubles. We got everything. If you are, yeah, are part of the SoCal community and like you want to get into the community, this is the event to go. This is like, hey, it's a new year. It's a new goal. Like, hey, show up for one time. Introduce yourself, and it's a good place to like meet people. Because honestly, some of my closest friends I met through Smash. So like, it's a really good way just to like make friends and make like really good memories that like you'll be able to cherish throughout the rest of your life. All right. That's it. We only had two ads. I mean, yeah. I, I don't think we have anything planned for February, do we? Javi. No. Yeah, there was only two ads. We only have two ads. All the other ads were the the only other ads that I had on this from last week to this week have all been done. Yeah. Like Genesis Black. So, so we, do them Ge again. Genesis Black we did. Wait, can Tri they hear you? Try to show down we did. Yes. Yeah. Do them again. I'm not, I'm not going to pre-upload <laughs> those ads. I already took them we off OBS. You could have talked about how the videos oh, are starting on already. Why are they starting already? What the heck? Yeah, because we're starting. Yeah. All right, I'm muting. Bye. Bye. All right, I'm saying Terry's the answer here. Oh. And here we go. Here is the toilet blender you know combo. Oh my God, 53 percent. At least he managed to hard DI that so that he didn't get the zero to death. Man, that dash attack is silly. Every time I see it, he just like he literally just pushes his opponent off the stage. All right. And it just it sets up so far off stage. Ooh, that Nair kind of just clipping Nitro right there. The Nair again just like kind of trading with Nitro at an awkward angle too. And oh wow, the neutral getup getting read by Elegant. Getting the hardest to punish. Yeah. Now here's the string and I'll think to go for dash attack instead of the up B. You know, probably didn't believe that the up B would connect. But there's, oh my God, didn't get the bear, but you know what, it doesn't matter because he didn't have a double jump. I thought Nitro, or I thought Elegant was actually going for the coin again. But here we go. There's the all up there. There's one. There's two. He got a third one. And then now he is just even up the percent. But, ooh, did I say even up the percent? I mean, he just lost his stock. That's true. The hardest of punishes. That's not going to be a zero to death, but it's going to be a good amount of damage. In fact, every single time we see Elegant grab, get his hands on Nitro, uh, he puts a good amount of damage onto Nitro. And then Arsene appears. I was about to say, did Elegant almost die to that gun? Because, like, it looked like he got gift right there. Almost. Yeah. Oh, he, he got the fair one, but just didn't, like, hesitate for a fraction of a second, didn't convert into the up air. The up B into the side B. That's, and it was still active. What is this character? Oh, try reading the spot dodge, not gonna be able to find it. But he gets down throw the toilet fold and that will be the game one. Is it coaching if I tell Nitro to go Terry? I think you can tell him, but he's not gonna listen to you. I if he go if he's 2-0. If he's 2-0. If he's 2-0, I'll yell it out. Yeah. Because why not? Okay, well, but it probably would be coaching if he like reverse six O's with Terry. Right? Do you really think he'd reverse 6-0? Oh! Oh! oh my god, your your dreams. Your did dreams he do it? He did it! Yeah! Terry hype! <laughs> <laughs> I mean I know Nitro has a good Terry, but is it good enough to be elegant Luigi? Though? He pushed the button. <laughs> Emergency. <laughs> Emergency Terry. Oh my god. I mean one thing that he's going to have with uh, Terry is going to have access to that aerial neutral B. Oh, he's not dead. He's good. Um, which, you know, puts a bit of a wave in front of him. And will knock back Elegant. Kind of resetting the entire... Uh, putting both players back in neutral. All right. Yeah. Oh, he's good. He's good. oh yeah. Wow, that was a really uh, like cool recovery right that he did right there just to avoid uh, Elegant's down air. That's true. And now it's go time. Yeah! Just 
whip. Geyser! Power Geyser! Uh, he's the most anime character in the. He's more anime than Joker is. He's more anime than Cloud. Yeah, he yells out his moves! Uh. <laughs> Busta Wolf. Are you okay? <laughs> oh okay, well now Elegant's making great use of the plunger. Ooh, great spot dodge. First we're gonna see. Uh, jabs into down B. Ooh, there's that forward telling a uh, crock shoot right there. Interesting that he went for crock shoot instead of burning knuckle. Maybe he doesn't want to stay away and waiting to attack on like another. Oh, yeah. If he now that he hasn't staled it, yeah. um, it'll actually kill at the ledge. Yeah. So you can see he's like looking for the F tilts. I mean, he's looking for F tilt. He's looking for jab. If he gets hit like two more times, then he gets uh. Yeah, but he's, he's oh, living. Yeah, but great di. Is he gonna do it? Oh! oh, that was it. He was winding up. He was like winding that, up. He, that move does have armor on it, but did not have enough armor to beat that move. It, the up B? What? I think that Terry's was a the answer. really good call out from Tempo. Nitro. Yeah. I think Terry's the answer. Oh my god. I mean, <laughs> his Terry's definitely been putting in more work than his Joker, that's for sure. Oh no. Oh, no. He can't escape. No. Oh, what are these down tilts? Are you just playing with your food elegant? All right, you deserve to lose. No, I think the reason he why. He deserves it. I, I, I believe he went for those down tilts because he knew that, like, straight up it wouldn't kill. All right. I mean, if that's the reason, then all right, okay. we're, we're cool. Yeah. I mean, Terry is like one of the heavier characters. In the oh, game, the Zara stopped the burning knuckle. Yeah, and shouldn't kill. Oh, oh, what was that di? Atrocious. I mean, that was like, that was one of those di's where like you weren't sure which way he was going to go. Because if it's on the inside, you have to di out. If it's on the outside, you have to like di in. It's like really weird. Yeah. But you can control on which side you go on. You just have to SDI, and then as long as you're like. You can pretty much see like where you started to. Okay, well, I thought that Terry was a good pick, but wait, I guess wait. not. Wait, am I, am I saying this right? Is this not a misclick? What, what is this? What? Since, since when did Elegant, Elegant have a villager? <laughs> like, I mean, right, I know you're it. up two games, but like, it's still like Nitro. I'm out of here. All right, I'm, I'm out of here. You're out of here. You, you, you don't want to see this shenanigans? The shenanigans? If I wanted to see Villager, I'd go play friendlies with Ann. Yeah, again, you know what? I feel like it's weird to, to see Villagers. It's because, like, they, they all pretty much play the same way. You know, it's just throwing out, you know, Lloyd Rockets and Fairs, you know, just playing that zoning game. But, you know, you can't really do that against Arsene just because, like, it just helps them build gauge and then, like, hey, you gave me free gauge, I'm going to end your life now. Yep. Speaking of ending life. Yep. It was like, it was like no risk to that play. Yep. What was Elegant going to do to challenge the down air? Nothing. That's what. Yep. Like, I'm just curious why he chose Villager of all characters, you know? He's trying to relive the glory days of when he would go Villager in uh, Smash 4. I mean, he did he have a Villager in Smash 4? I believe he did, yes. He played a lot of characters in Smash 4. He just really only played Luigi right. in the tournament. Except for those, like, remember those weird months when he picked, like, Gaming Watch and stuff? I mean, I remember seeing the Gaming Watch. I remember seeing the Mario. I think he's, yeah. I've never seen his villager. Like, but maybe he's just trying to work on the secondary yeah. for X, Y, and Z reasons. Look at that Rebel Guard. He just saw the Lloyd come out and like, yeah, I, I'll take some meter. Okay. I could use some meter. Oh, well, gets the berry. Doesn't run up for the up smash, and yet again, I feel like you say he's working on his characters, but this character is like very, very rough. Yep. If he wants to relive anyone from Smash 4, I feel like he should pick Game & Watch. Oh, I bet that Lord Rocket does a bunch of damage. It did, like, nothing. Oh, my God. I don't think that was the, the pocket did Lord Rocket. Oh, there's the bear. Oh, no. Oh, no. He, poor, he picked. He has chosen poorly on that option. Uh, oh, my God. 
But we click back throw, we'll take out the stock. Oh, are they connected? Whoa! Don't forget to check out Level Up Live because this is Wednesday Night Fights and... I mean, there's definitely a crowd at they, Street Fighter right now. The other games are always super hyped. Yeah. Yeah, there's Level Up Live, there's the um, Kevin Haas stream. If you can't remember. He always does like verses in Marvel and stuff. Right. There we go, there's oh. the jabs to just get him off of him. Yeah, break those knees. Side B. And yet again, like once he has our sand, he can just throw out all the Tetra cards and the card cards. And Up Smash will take out that stock in a convincing game three. Wow. Well, maybe we'll see Luigi again? I honestly think if he wants to pick up another character, it should be Game & Watch. Yeah. That's just me. I mean, Game & Watch is just an up B that's just like, okay, it may not kill you, but it'll piss you off more. Yeah. The ejector seat. Yeah. Just, I'm out of here. Like, oh, oh no. you thought you could hit my shield? <laughs> Wrong, sir. I'm out of here. Oh, thank you. Oh, yes. Uh, so much better. Yeah. And yet again, now we see the, the Luigi coming back in. Oh, and this is where the pain begins. You know what? Not getting an extension off of that last fair. Yeah, I don't think. Maybe he just had a little bit too much rage, so he was able to DI it a little bit harder. Yeah. Okay, but now Arson's here, and here comes the down airs. Oh. oh. I love Good that. He, yeah, and he just up aired slightly away from the stage to just barely avoid the, the edge guard, but not avoiding that one. Yeah, you can only avoid so many down airs. Okay, here we go. A little bit too much rage, though. Oh, but gets the re-grab. Just like, he ate 70% off of two grabs. Oh my god, that is disgusting. I call that combo the arson maker. Oh, he's even gonna stall out, but yeah. not long enough to avoid the re-grab punish. Hit by all those Aegons. Gets the grab into the forward air. He's off stage. Can he get a bear? Or no, he opts to go for guns instead. That's pretty smart because if he catches Elegant off guard, right. he might uh, just dip low enough so that uh, he wouldn't be able to make it back with just up B. Right. Oh, with a quick up smash out of shield, we'll take that stock. And now, no, Nitro's at 0%. Elgin has Rage. Pop, 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 pop. Oh, but still manages to make it back. No, I thought that, that second set of guns would definitely take out the stock, but... Oh, interesting. He was too much Rage, so the down air didn't connect because he was able to DI out of it. True, getting a couple down tilts. Oh, my God. Ooh. Did the up smash really shift his hurt box to avoid the grab? My yeah, God. Yeah, just kind of jump in the air. Makes sense. Oh, yeah. no. And this is where Arsene goes to buy. Oh. Yeah. That's kind of unfortunate. He, Nitro he knew that the back air was going to be coming out, so he countered. But <laughs> elegant <It> whiffed. <laughs> Dude, that, that's one of the most frustrating things about counters. That, like, when you read your opponent's aggressive option, but they're bad and they whiff it, and you get punished <laughs> even harder because of that. 